Hello, everybody. So I'm here with the amazing ladies. Hey. Intelligent, hey. strong, hey. independent, hey. outspoken. Hey. The vibe is insane. <laughs> I was invited onto my first ever IGTV show. Yeah. By Laden. Thank you so much for coming, man. Yo, I was honored. That yo, was within one was, hour yo, of yo. filming. And we didn't even plan. That's I know, the thing. I, I know. It was beautiful, man. You, you, you're really good, Simon. No, I'm not as good as you. I'm no, trying no, to hey. <laughs> Look at the highlight. One, two, three. Can we just appreciate the glow? The glow. Can we? No, yo. Can we just appreciate the glow? I mean, come on, come on. How did you guys find it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have this on my IG as well. How did you guys find it? Like how it was? It was incredible. It was, it was a great experience. My first ever IG TV show. Yeah. Nice. Like I think it's one of those things where. Because we've got followers on social media, but they yeah. don't get to see extended version yeah. of things. Yeah. So this yeah. is really, yeah. really refreshing. Like you guys can come and just watch my content. Yeah. That's sick. I yeah. love it. I'm here for it. Like so, I drugged you with chocolate. I know, right? Um, the, the the show is called uh, <laughs> Coffee with Laden, right? As you can you see. With the herbal tea. <laughs> I, I'm a tea. You know, my surname is tea. So yeah, I missed I the tea, so I had to drink tea. I understand. But um, yeah, so. Quickly, tell me a bit about yourself. Tell yeah, my people Safa. about you. Um, She's the queen. Who are you? Hey, you? I know, okay, I mean, so I'm Safa. Apart from looking amazing, <laughs> what do you guys do? Um, so I, I work in construction um, mm -hmm. for coffee shops. Mm -hmm. I also run something called Millennial Networking with my friend Elia. You've seen me a speak at event. mentor, Elia. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Um, and then I do a bit of business coaching on the side um, mm -hmm. through, it, through a platform called Rebel Coaching. Mm -hmm. Which is actually my... Uh, she's my boss as I'm well. Her coach so. as well. Oh. Um, so yeah, no, thanks for having me. I think the power of collaboration is it's powerful. No, you're you're really good. You have a good network as well, yeah. Simon. And and also meet someone like Safa is, yeah. is on it's also work with people that, that are from different tribes, but just mm. see what you can work with. Like yeah. let's yeah. say I might not necessarily be able to connect with everything you do, mm. but then the video bit I can. Yeah. Exactly. With her, she's yeah. not a video person, but like yeah. business aspect, that's what she does. Oh, I've so. become a video person. Hey, hey. I'm you have to. You have to. You know, hey. with Rebel Coach, you will be seeing more of me out there, but um, yeah. I need to go back to my spreadsheet. And that's nice. Oh, <laughs> God. Yeah. Build that in. Um, but yeah, no, that's that's what I do. But yeah, thanks for having us, Simon, yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Simon, well yeah, can, can I just say, I'm getting a bit of the glow yes. from these ladies over here. Yes. If, like, if, yo, I don't normally look like this, but because <laughs> I, yo, I had to. Blossoms. It's who you hang around with. You it's said energy. energy transfers. Yeah. The energy it does. Goes there. It does. For us to do babe. one hour of filming and without stopping. I know. I know. And just stop it because we want to stop. I know, I know. Stop it. That's the whole what happens when you're with um, people you get along with and you yeah, energy absolutely. speak about absolutely. anything with time yeah. is when and energy is contagious you know um, my name my name is Lovin I I've met you like through other mutual friend Alia yeah, which Alia. I love yeah. you Alia. Um, Alia and we miss you today I wish she was here obviously mm -hmm. making more food for us yeah um, <laughs> yeah like I, I to be honest at the moment I'm really focusing on Taco Network China is about just bringing people together um, mm. to promote activism, traveling and volunteering for young women, mm. and also just to bring a personality and put mm. personality the main thing of the drive mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and have a healthy um, lifestyle and mm. also just have your morals and not compromise on your identity and mm. whether that is being a black woman or being a Muslim woman or just mm. being a Somali, mm. whatever it is, Amen. like just mm -hmm. having my identity and as well as excelling and going far in life mm -hmm. so i tried to do that with taco network and the lovely Safa is helping me helping me put it together as well mm -hmm. so that, that, there's, there's a lot of projects and coming and, and we have girls coming in for documentary nights we have mm -hmm. girls coming in for football dance and mm -hmm. we have different themes and, mm -hmm. and i'm happy to be the hub to create this tribe and mm. it's such a family environment mm. friends environment we're part of the tribe yes yeah, yeah. yeah. we, we have <laughs> long, long, long lifetime tribe. membership and yeah <laughs> and, and my free time to be honest is all about mm. you know making the world a better place mm -hmm. um i started when i was 17 mm -hmm. um i i'm honored to have a platform where i can project my voice yeah and you're a real influencer Stop like it. you know you see like all these in insta it. models i love it love it whatever whatever you know you can, you can be a model whatever but but real influencers that are making a real positive difference like using their platforms you, to man. push yeah. positivity but, uh, that's my knowledge thing. confidence I just like throw. the whole i'm just like and hey. the real like you keep it real <laughs> like you really you keep just it throw real, a bit of a bit so, of and then, know, you, know, right? you know that's i think for me i feel like you know people are gonna see you on road one day yeah. 
People are going to catch you in your house slipping one day. <laughs> you know? Catch you in your house. Well, right? <laughs> <laughs> I know so, where she lives. Yeah. Where you live. I think the best thing you can do for yourself is be, be honest um, with yourself and mm. also with your stuff. But for me, humanitarian is the main thing. Mm. And that's, that's my main, main main focus and mm. women related subjects mm. and how do i make the world a better place bring people like you together and make yeah. you coffee mm. that's Yay. literally me making the world a better Obviously, place and, and i think, absolutely, absolutely. And I think I people that. feel <laughs> when 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 they think of changing the world people mm. just feel like oh my god i need the resources mm. i need I money need like big i need things, yeah. i need all of these things i need a huge venue like mm. nah you need one or two people and have mm. a decent conversation learn from them and move on to the next stage mm. so my way of changing the world is being as brutally honest as I can, knowing mm. that some people will never sponsor me, of course, yeah, knowing yes, that yeah. some companies will never reach out to me. But guess mm. what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do well in life, and I'm mm. not gonna need them. And Absolutely. I will don't compromise Absolutely. your morals, my morals. Absolutely. And I work really really hard to fund myself, so that mm. way I don't need Absolutely. sponsorship to live. Yeah. Um. So that way, what you see is what you get, and I get mm. to be myself. 100% and true. I love it and, and if girls follow my page and they can mm. learn something from it mm. then let it be like yo this is just winning absolutely winning. Yeah. Can, can I just say like yeah. for me I think one of the things I would say is that being yourself yeah. is the highest pinnacle of honesty like 10%. you know as long as you're not hurting anybody yeah. you're just, just be yourself because that's the Everyone highest point of honesty taken. Yeah, exactly, it's like taken said, like, and I think people need to understand that you have permission to be yourself uh, absolutely. Um, yeah. you know I, what, one thing I found working in, in like corporate world um, mm. people think oh how can you do your hair like this or how can you yeah. do, put your culture in there or how mm. can you me mm -hmm. I'm like boss I need the day off it's Eid <laughs> it's Eid and they're like what is Eid like, I switch yeah. I switch what do you mean what is Eid what you better Google, Google that shit Google, I'm telling you yeah know. you know uh, don't be afraid that you know you have to hide your character your morals yeah. your yeah. behavior your yeah. culture to fit in to fit in, to fit in. 2018 if, if, we don't do if that if that yeah, exactly. sponsorship or that brand or that company it's not for you it's not for you it's not for you it's not for you you know it's like keep they moving. need to start editing <laughs> yeah 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 I know, absolutely. Stay absolutely. with me. They need yeah. to start editing. They need to start um, need appreciating. To yeah. And they need to start like making a bit of change because this whole world, if you look at uh, job stuff, mm. if you look at environments, there's always, yeah. whether, in, no offense mm -hmm. to you, but it's like men dominating. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, absolutely. absolutely. And, and, and straight white men. men. Exactly. That's yeah. in my yeah. point. So yeah. it's straight difficult. white old men. Yeah, old, <laughs> Middle yeah. class men. Thank yeah. you. So it's like mm. women dominated, uh, men dominate, and on, on top of that, it's like, white women are doing their thing but yeah. i think for your black women um i could speak for for myself it's very difficult but what you can't be doing you can't be compromising a lot don't do that you know mm. as long as you're not being disrespectful as long as you're mm. not being rude or harmful you really really need to start speaking and mm. if a company is making you feel uncomfortable you mm. need to start speaking yeah. if your boss is making you un uncomfortable you need to start speaking yeah. if you're like you know the university is making you uncomfortable you need to start speaking there's, because there's laws that if you take that you, you know yeah, what i mean thank like, you. if you start if you continue mm -hmm. taking the l's and you're like oh you know what like i don't mm. want to lose my job da, da, da. like i wouldn't ask you to put your job and your livelihood at, at risk. risk yeah but I will mm. tell you that there's law, there's people who can help you. Mm. Um, you can share your issues with the other girls who can feel the same way. Mm. But I think it's this year and mm. on. Mm. Words, we really need to step up our game and to, just we say, need to like, do the most. Like, mm. you know, back in on. the day, there wasn't a lot of um, rights for people with disabilities. Yeah. Mm. But they campaigned. And exactly. They, campaigned and they, they got campaigned. to where they are. Yeah. Gay, gay rights. Yeah. That was non existent. Yeah. Now, yeah. no offense, but they, they have more rights sometimes than others, right? Yes. Yeah. So yeah. I think. As as ethnic, as mm. black, as mm. minorities, we mm. need to start being like, oh, you don't like you don't like me from where? I, okay, bye, bye. Yeah, yeah. Bye. it's like yeah. you know, yeah. because we have so much to give. Mm. Why do we need to just? You need our culture. You need our body. Yeah, exactly. You need everything. <laughs> like, you need everything. I know. You know? <laughs> and you don't want to acknowledge you know? me. I know. I know. You know, and I think I think we need to stop a bit of this victim mentality.